And I can. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Hey, it's been a while. So, okay, so it's been a while since we released an announcement video or an update video, and which, please bear with me, it's really hard to make a video since I'm really the only person working. Uh, my buddy Angel has been helping me out a lot. It seems like my buddy Anthony is going to be helping out too. It's just, um, we've been going through a lot of changes. Um, the uh, last video that I that we uh, really really made was uh, Nerf Star Wars uh, with Brandon and Brit. Brandon moved over to uh, Oregon, Washington, Oregon. Pretty sure it's Oregon. So that's been going on. Uh, my sister's back finally. She's been living in San Antonio. She moved here, and her boyfriend came too. So he's bunking with me on that bed. So we've been getting through those changes. Uh, we, I've been mainly focusing on uh, Rise with Cap, which I made for Washington Elementary, and thank you guys for letting me come out and shoot. That was really cool, and it was a wonderful experience. Um, but now, uh, let me just walk you guys through on what's been going on. So, first things first, it is kind of hard, really hard to fund these videos. Uh, where was it? These things cost money, so we don't have a Patreon set up. I would love to set that up, except for um, one of the things that I really don't know what to do for you guys is basically like what you Patreon people get. Um, normally, what happens is you there's different tiers, and depending on what tier you get, certain stuff. And I don't even know what to give you guys. For the fact that I don't really have anything to give you other than behind the scenes and like how we do things and that shouldn't you shouldn't have to pay for that which is my uh, thing information should be free and that's just that's just my opinion um so for now i have set up a paypal.me link on uh on on paypal so what will happen is is that if you guys are willing you can donate money to this channel which will give us uh money to go towards other things we want to do we want to set up a uh secondary channel that's all behind the scenes so that we're gonna try to really hard to at least bi-weekly get you guys videos so then you guys understand like what's going on behind the scenes and it's not like we're trying not to do anything it is we are trying it's just it takes a while and unfortunately with YouTube you have to be consistent and trying to get a film ready and done is you can't really be consistent with that so moving on to the behind the scenes channel it's going to be called Luke and Angel. Angel's been helping me out. He's going to be an official part of the team. And uh, we are trying to figure out a logo, trying to figure out banner art. I need to figure out something with Photoshop. And unfortunately, with Photoshop, you have to pay a subscription. Where I am at now, with everything else that I'm having to deal with, I cannot afford a subscription. So I'm going to be going and using um, GIMP. Yep. GIMP. So I'm going to learn GIMP and figure that out because that seems to be a lot like how Photoshop works. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to be learning that. So then the next thing that's happening is for the actual video that needs to be, that will be made for Luke and Angel, we have a uh, the camera to be filming the behind the scenes. Now, what I'm using right now that you're seeing me through is the Rebel T6i, right? T6i? No, just the Rebel T6. Never mind. And... I'm using the starter lens that came with it. Now, when we're shooting the actual film, that's going to be the camera I'm using because that's the best camera I have currently. Now, it occurred to me I don't have an actual like DSLR for the second channel, and counting that with a lens that would be perfect for this film, it would cost me around eight hundred dollars, exactly eight hundred and twenty-three dollars and ninety-nine cents. Now, the way I'm going to work around it. Because we're still young, still fresh. I have an action cam that I bought off of Amazon for 40 bucks. It works really well. I've enjoyed it. So we'll be using that for behind the scenes. And I'll be using the Rebel T6 to film the actual film that we're making. Which onto that is going to be called The Duel. The Duel is a short script. Brandon has sent for me. He came up with it. He typed it. It's easily going to be a maybe one minute film. Maybe a minute 30 seconds. Not initially sure yet. Um, and he sent it to me. And it was, it was kind of funny, it's just a short skit, something simple, that I hope that I think you guys are just like as out of pure entertainment. Now, we are getting into Lego stop motion, and so with Brandon's permission, we are going to turn the duel into a Lego stop motion 
short. Um, kind of just so that way we can learn some more things about it and get our hands dirty and, you know, learn it. And so, in that, we have to build the set, and then we have to shoot it, and then we have to edit it. Not a big deal. Um, after that, the next really big film that we want to do, or not really big, uh, really big for me is like how we've done Nerf Star Wars. Uh, that took us a while and that took a lot of effort. And so, but the next big thing that we want to do, because we want to try to scale up, we want to be bigger. And so the idea is, is that we want to tackle bigger ideas that aren't essentially going to kill us. Um, so, we've come up with the idea of Lego Solo. A couple of months back, I created a script and storyboard with my uh, step cousin Caleb, and he and it was really funny. We we're playing the original Star Wars Battlefront, and we had the idea sparked. Um, unfortunately, that's not what we're going with because I don't have any of the ships or sets that I need to create that particular film. I was going to wait until we went to the Lego store in downtown Disney. We got there and they had nothing from the Clone Wars era, so I was like, okay, well, you know what, we're going to figure this out. Um, I put money aside specifically for this trip, so I'm like, I'm going to spend it. In that, I looked at the collector's edition uh, Star Wars sets because those would be more detailed. They'd have more Lego pieces involved to make it look more realistic to what the movie was. You know, except for the fact that it is Lego. We looked, we found a Y-Wing, we found Slave 1, we found a Snowspeeder, and I looked at each one, because the other thing was, it's like, okay, well, if I'm going to use characters from these sets, I'd like to have a lot of characters. And so we looked at the Y-Wing, which came with Gold Leader and his R2 unit. Uh, we looked at the Snowspeeder, which only came with two pilots, and that one of them wasn't even Luke, uh, or Jack, which was kind of sad, and then Slave 1 came with Stormtrooper, Boba Fett, Han Solo, Han Solo Frozen and Carbonite, which they redid, by the way. Um, and a best in guard. So that was pretty cool. And I was like, okay, well, let's get Slave 1 now. How, what corresponding set do I want to get to go with Slave 1? And the obvious answer to that was Han Solo. The Millennium Falcon that was at was $800, and I was not about to spend $800 on that one set. So we went to the next best thing, and we got the new Falcon from Solo, a Star Wars story. Um, so I'm going to do some research, obviously, I want, not saying that this is going to be part of the canon, but I'd like it to be kinetically correct, so anything that we reference or anything that we do would fit in the larger canon, but it's not canon, I want to explain that right, right here and now. Um, I've already started typing the script, I'm having, I have some pretty much basic ideas that I do need to flush out, been busy, so I haven't had the time to sit down and do that, I will create the storyboard, we'll draw out every single shot so we know exactly what, what we want to do, and then build the set. So that is in the works, uh, we're getting pretty excited, donations would be helpful because the idea is we do need more Legos, um, some things we are going to make out of paper mache just because I have lots of cardboard, I buy things off Amazon all the time, or uh, you know off the internet in general. If you guys have seen the Ultra Saber unboxing video, you've seen all of that, so you know that I buy things all the time. Uh, that's pretty much our goals for green screening studios. Um, setting up the second channel. Those are the two kind of major films that we have underway right now. Um, I do need Tuesday. I do meet with a principal at another elementary school to see if she would like another video. I meet up with her on Tuesday. Moving on to the next thing, which I don't know if you guys would be excited about, but I would really like, like you to talk about this in the comments. Is we are creating a gaming channel. We have the logo ready. We have the name, it's going to be called Couch Party Incorporated. Um, right now, it's just we need to create the banner art and we need to make the video. So as I learn GIMP a little bit more, when we have the banner art, we'll make a new email address for it and then we'll go and we'll jump in front of my green screen and we'll go ahead and just start taking pictures and I'll create the long banner art that will be at the top. We want to make this look as professional as possible, even though we're a bunch of noobs at it, which is fine. Hey, okay, sorry guys, so uh, for whatever reason, uh, the, the video footage kind of just um, stopped out there. My bad, I'm trying to make sure I stay in frame. Um, so that's pretty much it. We're start, um, we've got the two Lego film ideas for the film channel. We have, I got an appointment with another lady at, um, uh, at another principal um, on Tuesday at three which is great and then you know the gaming channel is going to be coming up pretty soon too so um keep your eyes out for that we are kind of in the middle of getting stuff 
Um, I do want to go get a capture card. Yes. Um, we also need to figure out a way to just record things. And so there's, there's, there's. Anyway, those are the stuff that's in production. Two Lego movies, another video for school, and the gaming channel. So just keep your eyes out for that. Hit the subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. And uh, comment down below what you think. If you like any ideas, if you don't like any ideas, and, and you know, tell me why. I'd really like to have a conversation with you guys in the comments. So just let me know, and um, I'll see you all again at a later date.